<laughs> oh, it's a going creepy juice. It's creepy creepy here, and today we are playing Dead Zone, as requested by Esaias Martinez, I believe his name is. If I pronounce that wrong, I am sorry. Uh, <laughs> but yeah, uh, we're jumping right in. If anyone wants some items, I have played this a lot previously with many other people, so I've got loads of items. Um, I've got a few keys if you're willing to trade stuff for them and so but I'm starting from fresh because I think it'd be more interesting for you the viewers so yeah uh, if you do want any of crap just you know get, hit me a message on Roblox I don't come on as often as I used to because it is kind of like an old thing it's more nostalgic I didn't play it very much but anyway let's get into the game so go to the dead zone Ooh, we spawn in the city, I believe. Hey, we're near a city. Uh, well, the map's new. It's a new map. And it's very laggy. Uh, let's see if I'm gonna turn the settings down. Oh, amazing, the settings are down. Uh, well, I guess we'll have to deal with the lag fest. Huzzah, lag fest. That's not a huzzah moment. Uh, but yeah, we're just gonna find some items and do some stuffs. The new map is pretty good looking so far. I mean, I have played this for about 10 minutes, but it wasn't lagging earlier, so I'm not sure if it's because I've got some other background programs running, like the internet and stuff, but yeah. Uh, the developer is Zack Zack, uh, Dead Zone Zack Zack. Uh, he makes loads of cool stuff, check him out, um, so yeah. And, there's a similar game, which in my opinion, purely for the fact that, um, I, it doesn't lag, and also the f it's just generally better in my opinion. I don't know, because with the toxicity, if you can see in the thing, in the GUI with the visibility, audibility, blood and all that crap, uh, it says toxicity. I hate the toxicity update, because now it means if you get bitten by one zombie, you're screwed. Like, unless you find these quite rare items, you're dead. And it just sucks so much. So I greatly prefer um, Apocalypse Rising to this, although I'm not saying it's a bad game, because by all means it is really good. Um, good news is that soon I am hoping for my birthday to get a new computer, so hopefully no games that I get will be laggy. Everything will be pretty smooth and it will only be internet lag from then on. Uh, I'm hoping everyone's probably going to say, oh god, you're getting the Alienware, blah, 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 but I'm getting an Alienware computer. It's simply for the reason that I don't know all of the specs, I don't know what's the latest graphics card, because I'm not interested in that stuff. I'm interested purely in the gaming, in the internet, I'm not in it for uh, having a spasm over the graphics card. I simply want what's good enough to run what I need to run. But yeah. Ugh, oh, crap, I'll be run, 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 run. I probably shouldn't be running through the city like this, because a zombie will probably eat me. But oh well. I'm gonna see if I can climb that tower and see if there's anything cool on it. But yeah. Um... Because of the new map, it's quite laggy, which kind of sucks for you guys and for me also because I'm playing it. But eh, it has to be dealt with. Dum 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 dum. I can hear someone nearby, but I don't know who it is. Also. Uh, if you check out the channel, it has a little bar of either people that are in Creeper Griefer or other people that we 
quite enjoy or think that you guys should subscribe to. And so I'm just saying, if you go check that out, it, uh, there's only a few people on it now. There's only Data Leech, which, if you didn't know, is Exile of Fire, our latest member of Group Groofer. And uh, Subscriber Vision. Subscriber Vision is a very, very good subscriber. Like, just go subscribe to him now. If you're watching this video, subscribe to him now. He's a cool person. He, he does similar videos. Pretty much all of them are Roblox. Uh, but he is a cool guy. Just yeah, just go subscribe to him. He'll make his day. Hell yeah. So yeah, we're just searching through here. Let's see if we can find a gun or something. Seems like we can't. So we'll leave, I guess. But yeah, we're gonna climb that huge tower and just for the hell of it, jump off of it. Hell yeah! <laughs> nah, I'm joking. But hopefully there'll be some good stuff in it. Although I think I might want to head to that flag, so... I'll go to the flag and then to the big building. Even though the big building's like there. But, oh yeah, I can see the building with the flag on it, it's just here. I may as well head towards it. Oh, this looks like sort of like a city hall sort of thing. Hmm. Oh, this is pretty cool. I'm guessing this is set in America, considering the American flag, or at least it seems like the American flag. Let me know. Well, I'm just gonna have a little look in here. It doesn't really look like there's going to be oh, zombie run. Nope, there's nothing but zombies in there, so I might as well just head straight to the tower. To the tower of power. <laughs> tower of power. In fact, that's going to be the title of this video. Tower of power. Hell yes. If you do see me online, which you probably won't, because I don't really come on this particular game. I will be on Roblox every now and then, but I don't really come on Dead Zone very often. You'll probably see me on Apocalypse Rising if I'm on a zombie game. But if you do see me online, if you happen to see me online, just, you know, say hi and stuff. Um, but I am always friendly, as in, if you shoot me, I'll kill you, but other th otherwise, you're fine. So if you see me, I'm friendly, you know, you can just come join me in a group or something. But the thing is, if I'm already in a group, I can't say that all my group members will be friendly to you, so if you do try and join, just be careful if I do have a bunch of guys with me already, okay. But yeah, we're just going to climb to this tower. We've got about two minutes left of the video. I might add a bit of Apocalypse Rising on to it to show you what I mean by why I prefer it. But gonna search the floors of this tower. It doesn't really seem like there's anything here, unfortunately. Just see what happens if I climb to the top. Maybe I'll find a rifle, you never know. That's quite often some good stuff. But yeah, uh, I do have quite a few hats. Uh, I have keys and crates, so if you want to trade stuff, just ask. I can probably just give you some, like, because I honestly don't play this very often. I think we're coming to the top of the tower now. Yeah, we are. But yeah, I'm probably just going to add a few minutes in of Apocalypse Rising, just so you, just so you can you guys can see what it's like. Just, just so you can see why I personally think it's better. Mm, zombies over there. Zombies. Dum 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 dum. Climb up a tower. I think someone's shooting from the rooftop across. Oh god, someone's shooting from the rooftop across. Ah, run! Run away! Anyway, I'm just gonna cut to when I'm at the top to save boring you guys. And we are back at the top of the tower. We found some crap. 
Well, the the video ended, but yeah, I found a sword just sticking out the top of this box. Just, just a sword. A <laughs> damn sword. Just, <sighs> a sword. Seriously. I found a goddamn sword on a roof. How many times do people do that? Like, you know. Is that natural? Do people usually find swords on rooftops? <laughs> yeah, well it seems there's a ridge around the rooftop so I couldn't jump off like I wanted to. Sad face. You can't climb over the rims like you used to be able to. Well, see you guys. Creepy creeper out.